Got a beat from Kim, and she can fuck all night. Hello, how's it going? It's Boy Chase Race Bolts here, coming back at you with yet another vlog. It's been insane recently. But today, we will be heading up to Chicago to watch the White Sox play at Guaranteed Raid Field. Now, those who have been around for a while may or may not remember my Wrigley Field visit three years ago, almost three years ago. Can't believe it's been that long already, but it has been. So if you wanna check that out, that came out back in 2018, around August. So not too long ago, I got this comment saying, why do you always look like you don't sleep? It's because I don't. It's because I really don't. I appreciate your attention to detail. So anyways, I will catch you along the way. Few moments later. The White Sox have very strict COVID rules. You're not allowed to go to sections you're not ticketed for. So that's bad for me because I always take pictures at the very top of the stadium. So I don't have a ticket for the top of the stadium. So I'm kind of talking to the employees like, hey, I'm just trying to go up here real quick, man. Let me just come right back down. I'll be fine. They're like, okay, yeah, yeah I got you. So I'm finessing my way through. We'll see how it goes. There was a ticket checkpoint. I just joined another group of people at random. I mean, they thought I was a part of the group. So I am in, baby. Check this out. I'm in. It's so empty over here. I guess just not many people come this way. I think this is another checkpoint, so I'm gonna have to turn around. Blocked off, turn around, finesse my way up here, baby. Now I gotta go back down, let's go. So there's a really cool part about the stadium, and that's the ramp, the escalators. They actually are on the other side of the street from the ballpark itself. It's the only ballpark I've ever seen that, where the actual ramps are across the street from the ballpark. That's pretty funny. But look, look at this, this is sick. Look at this, this is dope. I'm taking a picture, bro. Also, guess who's playing against the White Sox? That's right, baby, it's Kansas City. Uh, once again, I need to clarify, I'm not a Royals fan. I only wear uh, just to rep Kansas City, you know, as a city, not, not for the team itself. But, you know, everybody knows I'm a Chiefs fan, so that's why I have it. It was nine bucks at Ross, baby. I don't give a shit, that's a steal. But no, of all the ballparks I've been to, this is easily the most strict. You know, even on level 100, there's like four different zones. You need to show your ticket to go to those zones. It's so ridiculous anyways. Look at that, look at Chicago in the background. That's a sick view. This ballpark doesn't get great reviews, but I'm here to tell you right now, it is heavily underrated. This place is awesome. I think this is a dope park, <laughs> way better than Yankee Stadium. And not to mention, this is easily the best ballpark in Chicago. I'm sorry, Cubs fans, but I was not a huge fan of Wrigley. History aside, of course. How in the world did he hit that ball? But he hits it to deep right. It will carry, and it's gone to the opposite field. Salvador Perez home run for the Royals. Three runs. <laughs> That's right. Time for my honest review of Guaranteed Rate Field. The concourse was about normal size. 
However, the ceiling was much lower than usual. The food was great. I actually had this whack-ass Comiskey dog. The hospitality factor was great as well. On my journey to the top of the stadium, which was against the rules, by the way, two of the employees actually helped me get there because, well, let's be real, the rules were retarded. There wasn't much to the outfield concourse, but it was much bigger than most parks. The team shop was huge, might I add. So overall, not a whole lot to it, but still an above average park. Guaranteed rate field gets a 7 out of 10 from me. All right, I'm back, baby. Uh, I actually got back two days ago, but I just forgot to record this last bit. Anyways, here it is, Chicago White Sox mini bat. As you've probably known by now, every stadium I go to, that's my souvenir. Oh, shit, the mini bat. And I had a souvenir cup, but I think it's in the uh, dishwasher, so. You know what? Just, just flash it on the screen right now. That, that's it. That's it. It's pretty cool. So, anyways, with that being said, thank you so much for watching this vlog. I will see you in the next one. I still have Fenway Park, Citizens Bank Park, Globe Life Field, and Minute Maid Park to go. There's a good chance I'll be going to a Dunedin Blue Jays game. <laughs> By that, I mean Toronto Blue Jays playing their home games in Dunedin, Florida uh, this weekend. So, you might see a vlog for that as well. Anyways, I will see you next time. Peace.